In this video, we will be looking at TBC 2023.10 point cloud enhancements. We will look at the new advanced filtering point cloud workflow. Let's have a look at the advanced point cloud filtering workflow in TBC. I've already uploaded a point cloud and next we will go to the point clouds tab. Yeah, under extraction, you will find the new advanced filtering button. When you click that, it will open up the advanced point cloud filtering command pane. First thing you need to do is either in TBC, select the point cloud you want to filter, give it a new name. I will just do ground filtered. Now under the filtering options, you can click on the cell size. This will determine the size of the cell that will look at the amount of points inside and filter it accordingly. For this example, let's make it 0.5. Your filtering strategy will depend on what you would like to filter out. As we have selected the ground, I would like to use the minimum elevation as the point we would like to keep and filter accordingly. You can also use maximum elevation or take the average elevation in each of these cell sizes. The X, Y position of filtered points, you can select if you want to use the actual point in the cell size that's going to be used, or you can say it should use the center of the cell. Let's use the actual position. You also have an option to filter by polyline. If you have a polyline, Apply that over there in the tick box, select the polyline and then tell it what is the horizontal and vertical offset you would like to filter accordingly. If you want some more options, click on the advanced settings button. Now you will see the minimum point cloud density. So if you want to make sure in areas where there is sparse points, you can tell TBC what is the minimum amount of points you would like to filter. If it's below that minimum amount of points, let's say 5, it will not filter any points in that cell. Outlier point filter, you can now tell it to be too soft, moderate or strong. The difference between those will be seen in the filtering that you do, how aggressive it will be on filtering the points for you. Let's do a moderate one for this selection. Once you've done with that, we can now click the filter button. TBC will now run through and then filter the points accordingly. Once the process has completed, we can have a look and see what the resulting point cloud looks like. So let's close the command pane, go into View Filter Manager, let's switch off everything. So there we have the original ground, and let's just zoom in a little bit. Here we go, that's what that looked like. And now that we have the filtered, you can see that is what that would look like. There you have it. That is the new advanced point cloud filtering workflow for TBC 2023.10.